Morris the Milk Van was feeling harassed. Thomas and Daisy had cornered him at the platform, demanding to know who he preferred. Thomas doesn't know you half as well as I do, Daisy flounced. How can he understand your needs with a two-coach gap between you at all times? At least I remembered to bring him, Thomas retorted. I don't shriek about my responsibilities like some engines I could mention. Well, all that steam is bad for the milk. It's meant to be cold. Are your passengers meant to be cold too? They certainly don't have that complaint with Annie and Claire. It's Percy, if you must know. Morris interjected. What? what? His focus is solely on his work. None of this fussing or faffing you two seem to specialize in. Both tank engine and rail car blushed, as Percy howled with laughter from the shed. 